Welcome back. Uh, one of the things I find most often with my golfers is that they have really tight hips. Whether in an internal rotation pattern or an external rotation pattern, I, I see it all the time. And so it's something that can really be devastating for proper pelvic function, not only in the backswing, but also in initiating the downswing or transitioning from the top into the downswing. Um, so I want to show you a simple exercise you can do just on a piece of padding here. I'd like to see your hands directly underneath shoulder uh, and then knees directly underneath your hip. From there, you're going to make a clockwise pattern move with your hip and a counterclockwise pattern move with your hip. One of the biggest keys here is going to be keeping your pelvis as level as you can. So as you continue to gain hip mobility, you can make a bigger range of motion without letting your back or pelvis really start to open up. I would get both sides, make sure you go both directions on both hips, but it's going to be a great way to get hip mobility.